civil servants in South Africa are marching to the National Treasury in uh, Pretoria and eight other provinces. This comes in a bid to put pressure on the government over a wage dispute. Trade unions representing the civil servants say that they would continue to protest until their demands are met. There are over one million employees in South Africa's public sector. They want the government to improve their offer of increasing their salaries by 3%. It also comes after pay negotiations between the government and the unions fell through in October. The government had then said that they would implement a 3% hike, which was mentioned in the midterm budget. They have been trying to reduce their spending on compensation for civil servants. This makes up around a third of their total spending. Unions also warned of an indefinite strike if their situation did not improve. <laughs> Thousands of workers belonging to public sector unions gear up for one day protest following deadlock in wage negotiations. About 800,000 public servants are expected either to be on a go slow or not go to work today, which may bring many services to a halt. The protest action is being organized by public service unions affiliated with the country's largest trade unions. COSATU, SAFTU and FEDUSA. The government has unilaterally decided to give the workers a 3% increase while the workers are demanding 10%. COSATU has sent a stern warning to the ANC-led government that should they not listen to the workers, it will pay a huge price come 2024 elections. This is Carl the Normo from Peter Maritzburg, South Africa for We On, World is One. We On, now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.